Option A. If we need a Dyson sphere simply to maximize energy from the sun, without considering the preservation of planet illumination, especially Earth's, it would be logical to position the sphere as close to the sun as possible. As close to the star, a rotating and not necessarily solid, sturdy and coolable shell with energy collectors and emitters is created to obtain maximum energy with minimal construction volume. All received light energy is converted into another form, such as electrical, and then transmitted somewhere via radio waves or applied on site. Such a sphere is justified for civilizations of a high level, especially if it's a means of colonizing not their own star, but a foreign one. A construction of this kind is particularly relevant for white dwarfs. They shine without flashes and coronal mass ejections. They are small in size and luminosity, allowing the creation of a sphere with a radius tens of times smaller than around an active sun.